Grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched right up to the top of the hill and he marched right down again. Guess where we're going? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? That was my little impromptu sing-along. It was impromptu, as you can tell by my face, and I didn't realise it was coming. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. We have a new travel vlog for you. So one of our, I say this in like every place yeah. we go, one of our favourite places, but this generally is this one is, of our favourite This, favorite is, this is top three. This is yeah, top elite. elite. So we are going to the city of York for the husband's birthday, he is oh, the yeah. grand old age of 33. of 33. I thought it made it look like you forgot for a second there. You're like, and it is, because I don't know. I, I, uh, what's your name again? <laughs> <laughs> so we're going up for a couple of days. It's Sunday today, so we're going up for a couple of days in the city for his birthday. Gonna go and explore, gonna eat some really yummy food. You guys, mm. we've got some yummy food coming. And we've got some history as well. So I think we're gonna do Jorvik Centre, which is obviously to do with all the Vikings and everything and certain things mm -hmm. they got dug up. Uh, I think we're gonna do Clifford's Tower or the museum. Yeah, one, we have one, or, one or the other or both, we don't know. We're, yes. we're winging that. Um, and I think we're doing the National uh, Railway Museum as well. Oh, we do it every time we go up there. You know what we're like with our trains? We're oh, train over. geeks. <laughs> um, and it's a free museum, so we're going to go and have a wander up there. We are not having the staple of a holiday this well, time round. it's because it's, it's, not, it's a holiday. It's a weekend it away, is a isn't it? It's a weekend Come away. In the, in the, in the se comment section below, is a weekend away a holiday? I think it is. I think so. It's a, it's a weekend break. <sighs> anyway, we need some breakfast. So, where do you want to go? Well, I'm, I think maybe, maybe try Costa. I think maybe. It's only because he wants to be a basic bitch and get the pumpkin spice latte. That's if they're available. Well, yeah, but because I have never had one. And everybody goes on and on and on and on and on about it. And every year, I'm like, I don't really care. So I'm going to go but and have a... But now I'm like, I want to give it a try. I'm going to go and have a look, because I know Starbucks do it, but I think Costa do, like, a version. So we're going to go and get some breakfast. Ooh. Mm. I've got... Mm. A ice latte with a shot of hazelnuts. And I got myself a large chai latte with a shot of coffee and a bit of cinnamon. Because everybody at work was going on about how great it is, so I thought, screw it, I'm going to do it. Well done, guys, because it tastes great. It's very festive. Mm. It's very, like, spicy, but not, not like, hot spice. It's just loads of flavour. I couldn't yeah, have nice. that all year round, though, because it is it's kind of festive, I think. Yeah. And then we've just gone for... A little sausage bap. Oh, it's really hot. Do that actually. window up. There's no exterior sound. Um, you had sauce in yours, didn't yes, you? Yes, I did. Yeah, so we had two, two large sausage baps. Um, originally, obviously, I was thinking of like a pumpkin spice kind of latte. Yeah, but Costa haven't got it. Because Costa haven't though. got their autumn range at the moment, so but it's fine. I can try it another time. Not a problem. This tastes really good, though. So it's good. Yeah. These are really hot. It's really hot. Yeah, but it's really hot. Is it hot? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Me. I'm gonna take this like an absolute champ. That's not too hot. I've got a sensitive little mouth. <sighs> well, that was a lovely little sausage salami. Yeah. yeah. CD falling down the back. Oh, okay. Quite impressed with that. A little Costa sausage sarni. Got mm. four sausages in it, so not scrimping. So we're just uh, set getting, sat -nav up. getting our sat nav together. Well, I'm, I'm picking CDs because I'm old school. Yeah, we've got a car that does take a, 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 a iPod and we never use it. Yeah, because it's not really that great. Mm. But as soon as you press play, it just does everything in alphabetical order and it's really annoying. It doesn't annoying. shuffle. It doesn't shuffle properly. So, uh, so we're just getting our music together because we have to have good music for a road trip. Mm. Uh, so we will see you in a bit. <laughs>
Hello, my name is Mr. Bug. I'm going to be here on your journey because you are now in a traffic jam and I'm just going to come and keep your company. We have hit traffic. We don't know what it is. Adam is not happy. Yeah, adult store. Pulse and cocktails. <laughs> oh <my> fucking A-Road. <laughs> It's so weird! It's such a weird thing. I'm gonna stop off for a coffee and some potlucks. It's so weird. Just on a on a dual carriageway next to a petrol station is a uh, an adult store. An adult sex shop. We're going to lattes. station for our tea and coffee. This is cute, I like this. Historic York. It's a pub with rooms which we love and we are staying at number four. So this is our room. He's already, he's already made himself at home. He has to get the Wi-Fi done, which... Get that Wi-Fi. So, it's a lovely room, really big, really big and spacious, and we're at the front of the pub. Um, so we've got the road outside, the window open. It's lovely and cool in here. So we've got full-length mirror again. Hello. Uh, nice big TV on the wall and coffee and tea facilities. They've left us some Kit Kats. We bought these ourselves because I saw him being an M for 30p. Look at that, sorted popcorn. So that'll be like midnight snack after a few drinks because it is the boy's birthday, so a few drinks are going to be had. It's so old. Why are you doing this to me, God? Let the others grow old, not me. <laughs> it was really weird, actually, because they had behind the bar, um, obviously, the date that you need to be over to be obviously over 18 to drink in a bar and it was the 5th of the night 2003 i'm 1990 and he's 98 uh no 98. 19 1988 1980. sorry 1988 so that made us feel very old um so really nice big comfortable bed i think it's bigger than a double our towels and some nice little i love going to a hotel and getting like the little things to take home so yeah, this is our really nice, like, I mean, it's really quite deep. You can just sit and like people watch, which I quite like to do. It's a, it's a lovely day today. So yeah, you can see there the Gilly Gate, 
pub with rooms for two nights so we're saying from sunday to tuesday uh was 188 pound which i thought was really reasonable we're right in the center of york and we get free parking we've got a, a little bathroom now it is quite little but it's got everything here you know toilet you've got another toilet and you sink um you've and you've got to have a toilet you've got to have a I'll toilet be, i'll be honest I, I think i need that more than i need a bed you have to sleep on the floor and yeah. make sure i had a toilet <laughs> yeah but some places it's like a joining isn't it or some people don't even have on suites. No, I mean, I'm sorry, but if there's a joint in it, it's not a place I'm ever going. So it's a little, little shower. I mean, I don't know if my big ass is going to go in here. We'll have a go. Oh, no, it's all right. It's fine. Let's say we're only here for a couple of days, so I've already washed my hair, so I don't need to do that laborious task. So, yeah, this is it. So, lovely little... Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. I would say lovely little room, but it's not, it's massive. It's actually quite big, isn't it? It's a really big room. Um, so we are now going to go exploring. We're gonna go and walk around the Minster and go for some more. We're not, we're not going in the Minster. Walk, I said walk around walk the Minster. around the exterior. That's what I said. Marvellous, it's beauty. Yeah, we're not going in. So we're gonna go and wander around the outside of the Minister and go for some more drinks. little bush right down over here in the corner there and that'll just be our little secret and if you tell anyone that that bush is there I will come to your house and I will cut you window is like the oldest intact medieval window I think in the world um, they have restored it I think it was about five years ago but they will always constantly have to restore it so once they're finished they'll have to start again but it's just amazing even after the fires in York Minster that that has still survived it's outside yeah it's there look I can hear it. It's like going into your subconscious. Yeah. You know you want it. You want it. Get a nice sorbet. Get ice cream. It's warm. Yeah.
do that with a jumpsuit. Hmm? I follow him on TikTok. Do you? Yeah. Right behind me is the Golden Fleece. It's one of the most haunted places in the UK, probably in the world as well. Um, most haunted were there as well. Good old event the yeah. building. It's all rubbish. <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah, a little bit. But still, it's pretty awesome to be in there. We've got a skeleton at the bar and all that kind of stuff as well. It is a really cool bar. We might pop in there later. Yes, it's still open. <laughs> oh, shall we go for a drink? <laughs> I'm happy to come back here tonight as well. Go for a drink though. <gasps> it's it's tropical Thor. Thor's TP. <laughs> it's just meant to be closed. Yes. I think we might have to go for a beverage. Cold brew. They've got little food trucks as well.
<laughs> and if you can hear that guys, I was about to address you, got a bus parked. Anyway, who are these handsome people? So we are all dressed. We're I'm rocking it all black tonight. I've got Def Leopard, Spotty Skirt from New Look, and <laughs> White Snake Boots. So we are now going to go for a couple of drinks. Mm -hmm. um, and then at 7 o'clock, we are booked into the Pavement Vaults, which is a barbecue place. They do a thing called the Pit Master, which is what I'm tempted for. It's like just a bit of a massive tray of meat. And it's it so looks exciting. incredible. I don't know whether you saw it earlier. Uh, I, I might slow it down, actually. Um, I, I, I spotted a TikTok famous person and I didn't have the balls to go up to him and say, I know you, um, can we take a picture? I know you're, you. You're so cool. <laughs> We're not worthy! We're not worthy! We're not worthy! He's called Stage Door Johnny and he does like inspirational kind of motivational speaking because he's got like his lovely velvety voice and then he does things about like literature and all that kind of stuff about like there, there and there and like the words of it and everything. It's incredible. You, you, if people know like it, you grammar. know. Yeah, it's amazing. Um, I think he's a, he's a drama actor and everything like that. I was convinced that I saw him, and then I checked out later on on his Instagram and saw he had the same clothes. And I was like, "Yeah, it's him. He's him. He's him. It's actually him." But so, yeah, I was actually kind of gone. So I really wish I would have gone up and said hello to him. Probably could have got him on here, maybe. I don't know. But we just stood there, and he was just stood there like. I was like, I was like "Are you actually going to go and say hello?" He's like, "No." I was I like, "Come on then." I don't have the balls to do it. Not not because I don't have the confidence to go and talk to that person. It's just. I don't like bothering people. Mm. I really don't like bothering people. Like if they're out having their day and everything, and I don't want to go. This gives me, you know what I mean. I don't mind people doing it to me. It doesn't bother me. It just I I don't like bothering other people in case they don't like being bothered. You're just shy, Maybe. shy flower. So yeah, so, that was a little moment. It was yeah. So we've had a lovely little afternoon, just like pottering about, a couple of drinks as you saw. We're gonna have a little more drinks. We're getting on it because it's a birthday. Not too much though. Food. Ready for food. Do you know what? I actually did a little dance. I'm so excited for food. I'm meat. Give me meat in my face. Meat!
Oh, Jesus. Whew. Oh. I'm actually sweating. I've got meat sweats. <laughs> I've eaten too much. That was amazing. I, <laughs> I'm really uncomfortable. Like, it, it was so good. We had pitmaster stuff, so it was all like meat in a tray. Um, you had a flat iron steak. Yeah. And With like a garlic and a, like basil chimichurri yeah. thing on it. And then I had... They had wings, it had pork, it had pulled pork, it had it had mac and cheese, chips, uh, what else did it have? Slow pickles, Slow pickles, pickles, yeah, pickle. all that kind of stuff. Oh yeah, like a deep fried piece of chicken as well, that was amazing. The whole, I mean, I, I finished 90% of it. It was incredible, but god damn am I full now. We're actually waddling. I'm actually sick. waddling around. We're, we're on about going, just wandering around, just to try and get get shift this. I've um I've eaten so much, I've given myself a headache. <laughs> um, like just I think my blood pressure has just yeah. got up so high. We, just, eaten we need so to much. walk this off. That's Ratings false. wise, rating wise, for um, me it's it's a it's a five star, and a chef's kiss for me as well. I think. Um, I would say four out of five. Oh. Yeah, only because, <laughs> only because, number one, they got my order wrong. I asked for fries, but they gave me slaw, which is fine. Yeah, but the slaw was um, well nice. No, yeah, that was fine. Um, and then it took about 15 minutes for our drinks to get there, and it wasn't busy. Right. Um, yeah, I mean, that's a, was that, that really was not going off the point. Well, that's saying that I, I knock off points. I think it's just because I'm so uncomfortable and I'm in a bad mood. <laughs> Maybe I knock off points when there's no black pudding in the breakfast. So all right, it's fair enough. Five out of five for the food, but and just overall. Yeah, for me it was chef's kiss. Five. Christ, I'm just I'm so full. I mean, we're meant to be going to a couple more bars tonight, but in all honesty, I don't know whether we're going to. We might end up going for a wander, and then probably falling asleep on in the bed. Because <laughs> we have got a big day tomorrow. Yeah, so if we don't go drinks tonight, we'll do drinks tomorrow. We'll hit it harder tomorrow. So, so let's go and have it was a, it was awesome. And let's go and have a nice little wonder. So, as you can see right here guys, this is Clifford's Tower and it's covered in scaffolding. I've never seen that. The one time that we're coming here to vlog, we wanted to show you that and it's not going to happen because it looks like it's completely closed and being done with scaffolding. Should we have a wonder that? Maybe? Yeah, we'll head round to it but that's really disappointing guys, we might have to pop to the museum tomorrow instead.
I'm not having much luck with this hotel room. <laughs> TV doesn't work. Like there's sound but no picture. And then my side light's not working either. And we can't close the curtains properly. No. Like they're, they're pretty much completely closed. It's just a little bit at the top. There's a little bit, but I'm sure it'll be fine. And it's um, it's really hot. It is quite warm. So we've got the window open, but we're on the main road. So we'll see how long we last with that. But I've had a lovely first day. Yeah, it's been nice, is not it? Well, first afternoon. Bit of a downer about Clippers Tower, but... Oh, I'm very upset about it. <laughs> I'm oh. very upset about it. You don't need to change it, but I suppose you've got... You know, make sure it's structurally sound and stuff like that, but mm. it doesn't need a roof on it, but... It's a tourist attraction, isn't it, at the end of the day? Food has just wiped us out. Yeah, absolutely. I, mean, I, feel, I started feeling a bit better when we started walking around and that. Yeah. And a little pop to the shambles, which was nice. Yeah. Um, like so I feel better then, yeah. but I'm still exhausted. But as I said, I was up early and I was doing a lot of driving and we've wandered around quite a lot and had a few drinks early today. So it's yeah, not we like haven't we haven't stopped, actually. Yeah, we haven't, it's not like we've stopped, really. I stopped to have a shower for half an hour and that's it. Yeah, we haven't actually sat down, so we're getting all rested for... Tomorrow. Tomorrow. So when I uh, when I turn thirty three years of age. Oh, so he's got all his presents already. Mm. Um, so we're gonna sign off for today. Yeah, and then we'll see you in the morning for for stuff. For stuff. For stuff. For York stuff. For more exploring. So if we don't see you before, see you after. See you after. Take care.